huge factor on the greens today. They are playing lift clean in place because of the rains from last night and into this morning. That is a birdie that lands in the bottom for Patrick Reed at the eighth. And he's off to a good start with three in the first eight holes. Or through the mist, there is the third shot of Patrick Reed upcoming. I like his chances from the beginning of the week, Paul. He is just so good around these greens. Great chipper, great pitcher of the ball, wonderful putter. Players are reading too much break typically. This is going to go just a little left. Just like that. Really uh, hitting a lot of little knockdown shots. Yeah, but I'll tell you, Watson never missed the sweet spot his entire career. He didn't, neither did Freddie. I mean, they didn't always hit it where they wanted, but they never missed the sweet spot. And that's where Patrick Reed is today. That was a sweet spot of the putter. There's that illustrates what Patrick Reed has done. First seven holes yesterday at that plus three number since then nine under. Reed in the bunker at 13. The question is how close is that lip? He's going to have to get it up quick. Get up. Get up. Oh, it's not short, Patrick. It is really good. Welcome back here at the Plantation Course at Cop Lewis, second round Century Tournament of Champions. Patrick Reed with a putt at 13 to take the lead. Oh man, does he putt these greens well. Of course, he puts them all well. Tracer technology powered by Top Golf. Looks like a pretty good one there. That's the shot he used to win the Masters. Kind of that slamming kind of low bullet. Hold off cut with that Arnold Palmer finish. Patrick Reed trying to add another birdie to his card over at the 14th with his second. Now this club really has been a uh, useful tool for Patrick Reed. You don't win the Masters oh. without a good wedge game. Here's a little bit of that slope. That's a good shot. Chance to increase his lead. Yeah. Better by the second. Knew what he was doing there. Just walks right in, no practice stroke. Sets up a little bit like Davis starts from behind there, makes his practice stroke from behind the ball, then walks in and gets it done again. Seven under par through 14 holes. You know, yesterday, Rolf, we kind of talked about, you know, looking forward to the big left kick and the ball running down the fairway, but the tees, this hole's been lengthened a bit and they can't reach that big left slope, it's left to right, or right to left slope, I should say. There's a little trough on the right, though, where his ball is in it now. So watch this thing, Paul. It's going to end up another 30 yards down to the right. That's pretty good right there, Rolf. Hadn't seen that ball roll like that all week. The back of this green is higher than the front. It's not. This green slopes away. That's why you have to play for some release. Well, he said he was going to do that, and he has. Look at it go, Rolf. That's just hard to believe. Reed with a chance for the solo lead here. 25 feet across the back of this green. And oh, rattles the hole, almost broke the hole. Wow. On the tee at 18, he could have birdied 16 as well as 17 after a short miss at 16. Given as a big rip. And again, if you've watched this tournament through the years, it has been a rolling ball. This is right up his alley. Yep, big draw player. It's all about drawing 18, judging the elevation. Well, it bounces the question, and not very much. This is Reed. Good chance to add another birdie to his second round card to end the day. Well, this requires a perfect touch and a quality read, and he didn't have either one. Usually he's a lot better with those types of shots. By five, and he has done a lot of that with some one putting. Yeah, how about he's one putted 22 of 36 holes now. He easily leads the week in putting. Mate, one putted 63% of the greens. Are you kidding me? So he'll have to settle for just eight birdies today. Six yesterday, and Patrick Reed with his second round 66, which ties Neiman's opening round 66 for the round of the tournament so far.